Hello, hello, my favorite kindergartners. It is Mrs. Shivani from the Syracuse Academy of Science and Citizenship. I am here today for lesson 34 of module one in math. And today we're going to be counting down. So we got really good at counting up the math way. One, one more is two, two, one more is three. Today we're gonna to take that and flip it and we're gonna count down from 10 to one. Alrighty. Okay, so we'll start off with our fluency warm up, a quick one today. We'll do our application problem. We'll do a concept development story. We'll do your exit ticket. We'll talk about what we learned, and that's a wrap for math. Okay, here we go. We're gonna start off with our fluency game of um, green, red light, green light. But we'll start, it's, we kinda can do like green light, red light, right? But instead of counting up, we're gonna count down. So this dot shows us what number we start at counting, and this dot shows us what number we stop counting at. So we're gonna start at 10, stop at zero, count down, ready? 10, nine, eight, count with me, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, zero. Okay, ready, let's do another one. Eight, Seven, six, five, four, three. Good. I wasn't sure if you were going to get that one because I didn't say start at eight, stop at three, did I? I'm not sure. I don't remember. But nice. It's kind of tricky counting backwards. I really have to think about it. Okay, let's do the next one. Start at five, stop at one, counting down. Five, four, three, two, one. Good work. Okay, now let's get to our application problem. Look at these two plates. On the first plate, let's draw some grapes. Okay, I want to draw, I'm trying to get out my shape pen here to draw a perfect circle for you guys. Okay, let's draw some shapes. One, two, we're drawing grapes, right? Three, four, five, six, seven, Eight. Oh, that one looks a little silly, but that's okay. Let's make sure. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, that's eight. Now, on this plate, draw one less. Okay, what's one less than eight? If I'm counting down, eight, seven would be one less. So let's draw seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, Seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. There we go. Eight, one less is seven. Now look at these first, these two cups. In the first cup, let's draw six stars. Straws. One, two, three. Whoa! <laughs> That's a silly straw. Three, four, five, six. Okay, I'm not going to count this a half circle here as a straw. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, now in the next cup, let's draw one less. So six. One less. What number comes right before six? Five. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Six. One less is five. Good work. Okay, now let me tell you a story about a farmer. What do you see below? A farmer and some apple trees. Yes, listen to my story. Once upon a time, there was a farmer and he had a big apple orchard. It was harvest time. That means it was time to pick the apples. And the farmer picked his first apple of the season. How many apples does he have left? Okay, he picked one. Now he has one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So he had 10, he picked one, and now he has nine. The next day, he picked another apple. How many are on the tree now? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Let's see how many apples are left each day after he picks one. Okay, so he had eight, he picked another one. Now he has one, two, three, 
four, five, six, seven. The next day he picked one. Now he has one, two, three, four, five, six. The next day he picked one. Now he has one, two, three, four, five. The next day he picked one and then he had one, two, three, four. The next day he picked one and then he had three. One, two, three. The next day he picked one, then he had two. One, two. The next day he picked one, then he just had one. And the next day he picked one and he had zero. Okay. Let's do our play one more time. And this time, we'll just tell the story with numbers. So say it with me. We'll count 10, one less is nine. Nine, one less is eight. Just like we counted them one math way when we were counting one more. Now we'll count the same way, but one less. Ready? So we're starting off with 10. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 10. Ready? Count with me. 10, one less is nine. Nine, one less is eight. Eight, one less is seven. Seven, one less is six. Six, one less is five. Five, one less is four. Four, one less is three. Three, one less is two. Two, one less is one. And then what happens if he picks the last apple? He has zero left. Okay. Now let's play a game. I'm gonna put some apples up on the tree, count them, and then tell me what number one less would be. So here we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One less would be six, and I'll write it. Okay, ready? We'll do two of these. There's four. What's one less? Yes, three. Good work. Okay, let's do two more. There's eight up there. What would one less be? Yes, seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Good. Okay, last one. There's five up there. What's one less? You got it. Four. All right. Let me show you what your problem set for the day is going to be. All right. Not that one. That was last lesson. Topic H, lesson 34. So count the pairs. Cross one out. How many are left? Count the triangles. Cross one out. How many are left? Just two questions for the day. That is it. All right, kiddos. Good job counting with me the one less way. That was fun. Tomorrow we'll do one last lesson where we're counting the one less way and we'll order numbers from 10 to 1. All right, guys. Thank you for your awesome work today. I will see you next lesson. Adios.